Judas and the Black Messiah dramatizes the life and death of Fred Hampton, the former chairman of the Illinois Black Panther Party. Chicago police shot and killed Hampton during a raid at his West Side apartment in 1969. Hampton's son, Fred Hampton Jr., served as a consultant for the Warner Brothers film. A revolutionary, in which I am, we're never satisfied. UIC Black Studies professor Jane Rose is the author of Framing the Black Panthers, the spectacular rise of a black power icon. She says Black Lives Matter activists are building upon the legacy of Hampton and the Black Panthers. Long before black Twitter, uh, they knew how to reach people by using media um, and by addressing large publics. And there were all kinds of people that were um, attracted to the Panthers. It wasn't only uh, black people. Along with the movie, there is a push to get more people involved in activism with the Judas and the Black Messiah impact campaign. Jamal Cole, the head of My Block, My Hood, My City, is partnering with the campaign. You don't have to have no master's degree to make a difference, right? You don't have to have no law degree to listen. You just got to have that passion. People get involved in struggle and become quote unquote conscious one of three ways. Inspiration, aspiration, or desperation. These are definitely, these are definitely def desperate times. Will Jones, ABC7, Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.